Good morning, good morning, good morning, fam. It's Monday. Happy Monday, everybody. I hope that you had a super fantabulous weekend and you are ready to kick your kickstart your Monday off and your week off to a fantabulous start. So what is our quadruple M message this morning? Monday morning motivational message. And the message is this, and it's real simple, you know, go out and vote. That's right. Go out and vote. Uh, this uh, the Atlanta has been like on fire with um, last week, um, a former President Obama and Vice President Kamala Harris were here doing a rally and the city was just on fire and so energized. And it just got me pumped all up for the election and everything that's going on. And uh, she said something really powerful that I want to share and uh, repeat what she said and uh, what uh, Vice President Kamala Harris said is she said, your vote is your voice and your voice is your power. That's right. She said, your vote is your voice and your voice is your power. And do you know when you choose not to vote, that is the equivalent of you giving your power away to someone else. You're giving your power away for someone to make decisions that impact your life, that impact your community, that impact your family, that impact your country. And you take away your voice. You take away your power. You are freely giving your power to someone else. And we don't want to do that. You know, there's too many people who paved the way before me before you that uh, fought to give you that right to vote. And when you take the attitude or choose the narrative of saying, I'm not going to vote, it's not going to make a difference, then why do you think so many things happen? Um, even with the, the, even with, you know, just more recently, um, to uh, make your vote not count or to, you know, change things to where, okay, you've been moved somewhere to vote and you didn't know it, you know, there wouldn't be all of this energy um, to cause you not vote if your vote did not have power and if your vote was not your voice. So uh, don't take that narrative that your vote doesn't matter and don't take the narrative like, well, you know, neither one of them are good, so I'm just not going to vote at all. Well, you know, that's not a good narrative either because it's still allowing someone else to have your power, okay? And uh, we want to make sure that uh, we are doing everything that we can to have the most fantabulous life and to live our best life. And when we take allow someone else to have our voice and someone else to have our power because we simply don't vote, then um, we're also um, impacting the best life that we can live. And it's not just for the presidential election. It's for even the local elections. So if you're the type that only votes for the major presidential elections, then get more involved and change that narrative and start voting at your local level because the laws that are passed at your local level are going to impact you far more than the laws that are passed on a national level. Okay. So I want to encourage you if you are that person uh, that has that attitude of your vote doesn't count or you're not interested in politics or you are not political, then um, you still have a voice. When you say you're not political, you're saying, I don't also don't have a voice and I also don't have a power. Uh, and you do. So um, that encouraging message this morning is that go out and vote. Encourage those around you to vote. You know, uh, if you are political, then take the time to explain uh, political issues to those who may not understand so that they can understand their power, okay? So that is the motivational message for this morning. Go out and vote, okay? Because like, a pres like Vice President Kamala Harris said, your vote is your voice and your voice is your power. Okay. All right. So wherever you are and whatever you're doing on this super fantabulous Monday, may you have a super fantabulous Monday and a super fantabulous week. And we shall see you on the next video. Mm -hmm. How about that?